Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be another review video. I love doing these because I see products advertised like this water bottle. This is not sponsored, I paid for this. So this is the Health-ish water bottle. I saw this advertised on Instagram and Facebook. I'm like, all right, I'm just gonna need to get this water bottle. I'm a sucker for advertising, I guess. Along with the bottle, I also got this cleaner, which I love the cleaner. I have nothing negative to say about the cleaner. Um, it's made out of this silicone material um, and it has this like pole so it doesn't bend or anything if you can kind of see like it doesn't bend at all so my review about this bottle cleaner a plus i love it very good quality it was 15 dollars, i believe and this bottle was about 25 to 34 dollars i don't remember the exact price i think it was 25 because they were having like a sale or something okay so i'm gonna start off with the positives of this bottle because there's less positives than negatives there's more negatives when it comes to this bottle and I'm sorry but this is again my honest review of the Healthish water bottle first I'm gonna read to you what's on the water bottle because there's this little paragraph as you can see so it says we know it's hard to create healthy habits but relax we're not asking you to snort China seeds eight times a day which I think that's really funny um, start with more water a little each hour. Sure, you'll pee more, but each time you go, you're flushing out toxins. You also get more breaks at work. <laughs> true they're very realistic and i really like this company so this has nothing to do with like the company um i like their attitude and everything like they seem to be relatable to me the first positive i love is the design that is what captivated my eye and i was just like what is that? That's a really cute water bottle. So I clicked on the advertisement, obviously, and I clicked on it twice because there was one time it really caught my eye. I'm like, oh, I really like that. I'm like, eh. So I kept scrolling. And then another day I came across it again and I was like, okay, I need this. So I clicked on it and actually ended up purchasing it. But the thing that really caught my eye was the design. The design is so cute for pictures, the gold with the clear, um, like frosted glass, really my style, really my aesthetic as some people would say. Um, I love the design. Another thing that I really love about this water bottle is the timestamps. I love the timestamps. Um, it says full 8 a.m., 9 a.m., 10 a.m., 11, 12, and then refill. I have a quick funny story about the timestamps, but uh, when I first got the bottle, I didn't really realize there was another side that said two, three, four, five, six, and then refill. So I was like, okay, when you get to the end, why does it keep on saying refill? I was really confused because I just thought it only had the 8 a.m. to the 12 p.m. And I'm like, okay. And another really confusing thing is on the other side, it says two, three, four, five, six, and then it says refill. So like, when are you supposed to stop? I guess you're never supposed to stop drinking water, but if you're trying to meet a goal, like throughout the day. I know that you're supposed to drink two of these. I don't know, it was just really confusing to me at first, but I'm like, okay, I think it, what it's trying to say is after 12 p.m., refill it up and then drink to the uh, refill at the six. But again, it says refill. I don't know, I was just super confused. But I love the timestamps. I think it's great for people who don't really drink a lot of water. So another claim they have on this bottle, which I think is great, Two of these equals eight glasses of water a day. And each of these is a liter according to the website. So two of these equals two liters of water a day. I think that's a really great message and I did not ever personally measure. I'm just kind of going off of what the website said and I believe them. So that's also a plus. So it's making sure you get plenty of water throughout the day. This bottle is perfect for at home or the gym. So you definitely want this bottle to be somewhere where it's like sitting and you can see it and easily accessible. So like if you're at the gym, you could set it next to the equipment you're working with and it's there. It's really good for when you're at work sitting, you could place it on your desk and you could look at the times. It's really good for those two places. The next positive I really want to talk about is the feeling of it. It's really smooth. Again, with the frosted plastic, this is a plastic bottle. It feels really, really nice against your hands. It's really soft and I just like the texture. Oh, and another kind of positive, this could be a positive or a negative. It does fit into a cup holder depending on your cup holder size. So it barely fits in my cup holder in my car, but in this little like fold out chair thing, it's kind of like a beach chair. 
it fits perfectly. Okay, so let's move on to the cons slash more negative things about this water bottle. If you are active, so if you are hiking or biking or jogging, I don't really recommend this. This is kind of large. It wouldn't like fit, maybe it would fit in a backpack, but you would need kind of a big backpack for this. I don't know. I just don't think if you're an active person um, doing active things where you can't be holding a lot of stuff, this is not the water bottle for you. Um, there's no like ring around it to like clip it to anything. And it's like large, so you wouldn't want this like hanging on the side of you, like bumping your leg, you know what I mean? This is a really nitpicky negative, but I loved iced water. I love ice. As you can see, my ice is kind of melting right now. This top, I don't know if you guys can see, but the top of the water bottle isn't big enough to just like put the bottle under and like get ice out. So I manually have to like, I know this is first world problems, but honestly, this is just a part of the review. So I have to go into my refrigerator freezer and hand put the ice into the bottle, which I don't know guys, it's just a little inconvenient. I could just put water in it, but again, it's just my preference. I like iced water. I like it super cold. Having to put ice in individually because the top isn't big enough is kind of annoying. Okay, so I'm just gonna hate on the top a little bit more. So I really wish there was an option to have a straw because, and I know this bottle is probably just for like active people like at the gym, but for me, I love straws because then I could just like sip out of the straw. I really wish they had like a straw option because this is another negative that I'm gonna bring up, guys. When you're sipping this and if you get a little too excited and you're really sweaty and you're just like, oh my gosh, I need water. you It's too big to put your whole like mouth around it. So when you sip out of it, it could easily just like spill all over you, which has happened to me like three times with this bottle. So you have to make sure you don't like tip it up too high and it's really hard to do when you're like really sweaty and you just want water. You're just like, you want to like chug it, you know? So that is definitely a con. I think this whole size is just an awkward size. It's too small to put all of the ice cubes in at once, but then it's too big to like put your full mouth around slash it doesn't have like a straw option. It's a very odd size. Like I'm gonna be completely honest. Like it's a weird size, but I like the design. So I guess I'm a little conflicted with that. Another thing I wanted to mention, it is plastic. I mentioned that earlier. So it doesn't really keep your drinks cold. It doesn't keep the water in here cold for very long. And as you guys know, I like iced water. So of course I have to put ice in here and the ice melts super fast because it's plastic. I think I would have the same problem if the bottle was glass, but I just want to say like it's plastic. So I don't know, the quality is good. Like the plastic's a good quality. It's not flimsy or anything, but I think I would give it more credit that it didn't keep things cold if it was glass. The next con I wanted to share about this water bottle is that it is only hand washable. You cannot put this in the dishwasher. And I know again, first world problems. It literally only took me like two minutes to hand wash this but still it would be easier if I could just plop it in the dishwasher and have it cleaned or whatever. I personally just don't like hand washing things and that's just me. So that's just a con for myself. If you like hand washing things, then that's fine and it's not a negative for you. So do I regret buying this? No, because it's really cute. It's really good for photos. Again, I like the design and what I use it for. I don't ride a bike, I don't jog, so I'm not like moving my body where I have to carry this. I don't regret buying it, but do I think it's worth it? Probably not, but for my lifestyle and where I'm at, it's perfect because I would take this to work and I would just drink it at my desk. Anyway, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any other questions or comments, let me know your thoughts down below. I would love to know. Do you think this water bottle is worth it? Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like my reviews. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.